So now let's see how we can place and move objects inside of Tinkercad. So here you can see that I have a blank project opened up. And if I were to go ahead and then select a shape right here, let's say for example, a cone and drag it in here, it is placed out. If I want to place it out in different places, all I need to do is click and drag this around right here and then place it wherever I want. I can click it, I can move it. And if I want to move it in the D axis, I can rotate this around by holding the left mouse button to change around the view. And then I can select this and over here you can see the little arrow which I can click to move it up and down. So let's say I want to snap it back onto the ground right here. I can just press D on my keyboard and then it snaps on back to the place. I can also use my arrow keys. So I can use my right arrow key, my left arrow key, my top arrow key, and you can see that the movement happens slowly right here. I can hold shift to move it faster right here. If I want to move it in the Z axis, I can hold control on my keyboard and use the up arrow key, hold shift, and you can see that I can do the same right here. I can press D and that is how I can snap it back onto place. And I can also bring in other objects right here, use the arrow key, move this around into different places or move this around in the Z axis. And that is how you can place and move objects within Autodesk Tinkercad. So I hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.